Hello everyone and welcome to your general weekly angel reading from Monday to Sunday. This is for everyone and I'm going to use the Archangel Gabriel cards to see what we need to know. So Monday and Tuesday Archangel Gabriel, what do we need to know please for everybody? Thank you. What do we need to know for Wednesday and Thursday? Thank you. And what do we need to know for the weekend? Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Thank you. Okay, so this is what's happening then today and tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday. First of all, we've got agent or manager coming up. And we've got this connected with time, the time management. So you can manage your time effectively this week. So if you feel you haven't got enough hours in the, way, in the day or things are in the way or time is in the way, time is illusion. It's man-made. So the angels want you to know that right now, that you can stretch time. You can have as much time as you need to get things done when you believe that you can. The angels are saying to you, Place your priorities at the top of your to-do list and don't allow distractions to deter your focus. So if you feel you haven't got enough time this week, remain positive, trust in yourself and know that you can get things done. And your work expands, your work expands its reach as you partner with a professional who can help you. So I feel this is about asking Archangel Gabriel for help, asking for guidance, knowing who you are. So the angels are saying to you this week, you are power and you are strength and you can manage your time effectively. So Monday and Tuesday, it may get off to a hectic start. It may be very busy. You may have a lot to do. And the angels are saying the angels will help you if you ask them to manage your time effectively. Wednesday and Thursday, express your inner truth. So in the middle of the week, you may find that you have to speak your truth a bit more to express yourself, to speak how you feel. Your creative work shines brightest when it reflects your genuine feelings and thoughts. So be true to yourself in the middle of the week. Speak your truth. Don't hide who you are, shine your light. And then your light will shine brightly. And at the weekend, deserving. Know that you are good enough. Know that you deserve the world, that you deserve everything the universe wants to give to you. The message says you, like all of God's children, deserve happiness, health and love. So allow the universe to deliver to you this weekend. You know, Monday and Tuesday, you may be very overwhelmed. There's a lot going on and you need to manage your time. Understand how powerful you are. And in the middle of the week, speak your truth. Tell the universe how you feel, that you feel that you deserve that thing, that you desire that thing and you know you can have it now because you are deserving of it. So I feel this week, it's a great week for setting intentions as long as you believe that what you can have can be real. So trust in that this week and know that you are deserving. You deserve everything and you deserve someone in your life who's honest with you, genuine and loving and kind. So make sure you're expressing the way you feel in the middle of the week in relationships. You're speaking your truth, you're saying how you feel. You may need to set some boundaries down because you deserve the world. You deserve all of a person, not just breadcrumbs. So stand in your ground and know that your time is important. The most precious gift that you can give to another is your time. So if you feel like you're giving all of your time and energy to someone and they aren't appreciating that, it's time you speak your truth. It's time you set boundaries and know that you deserve the world. Because when you feel deserving, when you feel valuable, when you know that you are your number one, you won't accept less than you deserve. And you open your arms to receive all of the magic of the universe. So trust in that this week. It's going to be a week about realisation. A week about realising the truth that this is moving forward. And the best thing is, on Saturday, we're going into the Chinese New Year. It's a doorway opening to freedom, to miracles coming into blessings. So have confidence in your creations and trust in who you are, that you create miracles, that you are the creator of your reality and you can bring in great change. So anything you want to change in your life, this is the week to do it because when we go through this door on Saturday, it's a portal to the new beginning of the new decade, a fresh start coming in a clean slate, a time for you to do what you want, be what you want and have what you want because you deserve the world.
So trust in this. This week, give it to heaven. Believe that you've got plenty of time to get things done, to do what you want to do. Time isn't running out. You have as much time as you need. So trust in that. You're not at the end of your journey. You're at the new beginning. A new beginning for you to bring in magic in your destiny. So trust that your destiny is moving you forward to where you need to be. I hope you've enjoyed this. Have a great week and I'll see you soon.